Hey guys, Edward here with Power Mechanical with a quick tip for your boiler rooms. So right here we're looking at this Honeywell 7800 control, uh, the Honeywell blue box as some people call it. And the tip that I want to give you is a couple things. For one, if you don't already have a display, investing in one of these will save you a lot of headache because you can uh, use it to really troubleshoot. They come with just a clamshell or kind of a blank cover and you can use the blink codes to troubleshoot it. But when you have the display, it can really save you some time and troubleshooting. But also they have a new one that's a four line uh, display that really helps out. And uh, it, it's, it actually has onboard troubleshooting. And the tip that I wanna give you though is putting these things in. I see a lot of times these things get broken because people force them. So just pay attention to the shape of these little teeth right here and the way that you wanna clip it in. You wanna go in, start pushing up and then straight in. A lot of times I see where people will just try to push them straight on and break those teeth off and then you can get a bad connection in here. Same thing with taking it off. You wanna pull from the bottom, out and up. So if you like these kind of tips, stick around for our channel. And other than that, we'll see you next week for another boiler room tip.